Ozfish have launched a project in Western Australia that is looking to restore and revitalise fish habitat on the doorstep of the Mandra Canals. Everything about this project is grassroots. Ozfish are targeting the places we all like to fish. Jetties, helping bread and butter fish like black brim and doing so with the help of good old, hard-working volunteers. This is Pin My Jetty, a project proudly brought to you by Lawrence and Wreckfish West. Yeah, so we have a, a local chapter down here in Mandra, and this is one of the ideas that um, our local members brought to us, our local volunteers. So they were a bit concerned about a uh, decline in the local mussel population, especially on some of their own private jetties, and this was one idea that they had to um, try and remedy the problem, bring back the mussels to Mandra. So what we've been doing is uh, we've been installing these biodegradable uh, mussel habitat units underneath private jetties in the canals. The ropes are all natural fibre, this is manila, the, the matting here is made from coir and these cable ties are steel, not plastics. I've lived in the canals for probably seven years. I've lived in Mandra probably for about 55 years. I'm doing some sums, always on the water, magic spot. I love the canals, beautiful. An excess of nutrients has led to an increase in growth in microorganisms, which covers hard surfaces in the water and makes it difficult for local shellfish to attach themselves. For the local chapter, less mussels meant less fish habitat, less food, and ultimately, less chance of catching a fish. I have uh, tried and over the years it's been diminishing, unfortunately. Um, years ago, you would have caught whiting quite frequently and brim um, and even flathead cobbler but um, that whole species range has sort of deteriorated or gone down a little which it needs it needs doing something to it it does we get that back um, it gives the majority of the people that live on the canal another aspect they they didn't believe i think for most of them that they could contribute very much research has shown that mussels once made up of 64 percent of a black brim's diet in the area with that number now down to 19%. The benefits of mussels don't stop there. Aside from being a food source, mussels filter pollutants and nutrients from the water, acting as the lungs of the Mandra canals. Yeah, I, I think the Pimp My Jetty uh, uh, project is going to be a bonus for the canal system in Mandra and the fish life. Um, it, it'll be the start. It makes the, it'll give the opportunity for the people to be aware that they can contribute. They'll see the product, they'll see the growth, they'll recognise as the fish come in that they've got a hand in, in promoting that fish life. I would hope, I believe it's happening. I'm already getting some growth on there that would give the fish a little bit of protection uh, because the small ones have to come first and then the bigger ones. So the small ones, we look after them and then the big ones will come in. But um, it's no encumbrance to me it, and it's just, a, it, you're doing something creative for the environment and that's the main thing. You know, we're doing something constructive Projects like this are a group effort. Pimp My Jetty couldn't happen without the support of Lawrence and Wreckfish West, and is possible thanks to all the volunteers and private jetty owners who have donated their time. To find out more or to get involved in projects like this, head over to ozfish.org.au.